First, switch your tablet on by holding the power button down on the side of the device. After a few seconds, the tablet screen will turn on. We're using a Samsung for this walkthrough, but the process will differ depending on what Android device you're using. On the welcome screen, select your language and click Start. Next, you'll be prompted to select a Wi-Fi network. The tablet will scan for local network connections. Simply select yours and type in your password. If you don't know it, it should be printed on the bottom of your router. Tick the box to confirm that you understand and agree to the terms and conditions, and then decide whether you want to provide usage data. Then press Next. Now decide which Google services you want turned on. For example, location services. Enabling this allows Google to feed your location into different apps, such as Google Maps, and use your location to tailor search results. Again, this may differ for different Android tablets. You may be asked to set up different accounts, again, depending on your tablet. We're going to skip this for now. And we'll do the same with Dropbox. Your Android tablet will now boot up properly for the first time, and you'll see your home screen with a selection of app icons on the display.